Alrighty, hey guys, just want to make another video and uh, with this morning's video, what I want to do is I want to give you guys some useful shortcuts when using uh, the handy gym and by like, this is going to save you a lot of time, you know, which is the main point of this and will help you get into an exercise a lot faster. And so the number one shortcut that I've learned so far that I would teach everybody is learn how to shift the rebound point, okay? What do I mean by that? Well, check this out. This happens quite a lot. Once you get this device, you know what I'm saying. Let's say I set this up and I find out, let's say I'm going to do it with a simple example with a bicep curl, so you can see what I'm saying. Let's say I find out when I do a bicep curl, it, it cuts short. Do you see that? So I've, and I realize, oh shit, I've set the wrong rebound point. You know, what do I do? Well, what most people will do in the beginning is then they'll undo the cord and they'll go through that whole process again. And you don't want to do that, eh, Charlotte, right? No. So how do we shift the rebound point to the point that you want to be at, right? And so, let me explain this. I need to go really slow. Because if you've never used the handy gym before, you might know what I'm saying. What you do is you go back to, you go back to the your rebound point, which is at the top there. Do you see that there? Yep. That's the point of rebound, okay? And we now know that this isn't the right level. I need to shift it upwards. How do I do that? Well, you hold it here at the original rebound point or where the cable is fully extended. You then open up the rope regulator, which is what I'm doing here. I'm then now shifting this upwards. All right, a little bit over-exaggerated, right? And now I've created a new rebound point. Does that make sense, right? We just went from here to here. And let me prove it, okay? I'm going to wind this up, and you're going to clearly see that the rebound point has now been shifted, and this is going to save you a lot of time, trust me. Right? Do you see how now it's going, see how it's going all the way up now? Right? So, that's the first tip, is learning how to shift uh, rebound points. Now, the second shortcut that I can uh, teach you, which is, you saw me do it in the previous video, is when you do set the rebound point, they say it's up here, right? A lot of people, what they do is, to get the exercise started, they'll start turning this. Do you understand, Charlotte, right? Yeah. Start rotating this. yeah. Now, if I rotate this, and I have to go all the way down to the end, that takes way too much time. A bit so, tedious. Yeah, so what do you do to shortcut this? Well, what you do is, you, you wind up only a little bit, okay, like this, and then you pull up, and you let the device do it itself. Do you see mm. it there? And now I'm into the movement. You know what I mean? Without having to spend so much time trying to wind it up. So that's the second shortcut. Very useful, right? Now, the third shortcut is uh, setting multiple exercises to one rebound point. And the only way I can show that to you is we're going to undo this attachment here. Okay. Uh, I mean, you could do it on this, but the only way I know how to do it is on the door. So Charlotte, come this way. Set the cable out. I'm gonna give an example of what I mean. Okay, I saw a guy do this, and I was like, man, that, that's useful. That was a good trick. So, all right, I'm gonna set to the door here, and let's say I want to do uh, multiple exercises, but I don't want to constantly keep readjusting the rope, right? Setting different rebound points. You just want to set one rebound point. How do you do that? Well. This is a lot of trial and error, and this is just something that you need to learn. So let me give an example though of what I mean. So, right, let's say I want to do like a seated row action, right? So I'm going to lock off the cord here. Okay, so let's see guys, it's out of the way. Let's wind this up a bit. And once again, you're going to see me do that second shortcut. Yeah, it's all about troubleshooting sometimes. So that's the second shortcut, you see that there? See, you saw me do it, right? Yeah. Right, so now, this is the first exercise. Sorry guys, I need to, <laughs> it's hard for me to explain this to you unless you've used the handy gym, okay? Look, the first exercise is a seated row. Check this out, okay? You see that there? Not only that, I can now do a different exercise. But guess what? It's only at one rebound point. Does that make sense? You can go there. Alrighty, so as you guys can see there, 
That's a very useful shortcut if you're looking at saving time, right? Setting multiple exercises to one rebound point. So anyway, hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope this makes sense, right? Watch it again if you need to, and have one. See ya.